Hi everyone, I'm Christy, your cybersecurity engineer, and we are back again this month with 4MAC to discuss, of course, another cybersecurity topic. Throughout the months, we have discussed a series of topics regarding user safety. We have mentioned social engineering attacks and phishing attacks. What are they and what can we do in order to protect ourselves from getting a victim or targeted from this type of attacks? But the thing is, we haven't discussed about the part of what happens if you actually get targeted and become a victim of this type of attacks. So this is what our video of today is going to talk about. And here are five essential steps that you need to take if you have clicked in a malicious link or downloaded a malicious file through a phishing attack. So the very first step is to remain extremely calm. I know it's difficult when we're talking about this type of attacks, but it's crucial to remain calm because you don't want to input any further information into this attack. So if you have already clicked on a link or downloaded a file, don't do anything else. Do not click any more further click links or just to click on the malicious file that you have downloaded. Just leave it at that. The second step that is very crucial is to get your device offline immediately. If you are connected through a wired network or if you are connected through Wi-Fi, it is crucial to get your device offline. Because if you have downloaded the malware and your device is affected with the malware, it is very important to get it offline immediately if you don't want from this malware to get spread it into other device or into your network system. The third step is to back up everything. If you haven't done this process regularly, then it's very crucial to get a focus on your most sensitive information that you have. That is the very first thing that you have to get it backed up immediately. You can back it up through external hard drive or even in the cloud storage. Then another step that is also important is to scan your device. You can scan your device for malicious malware if it's affected through antivirus softwares. If you can scan it, then you can understand if your device is actually infected or not. So you can get a better clear or understanding what is going on in your device. And of course, last but not least, is to fix or change every login credentials that you have on every single account, on every single website that you have registered or you already have an account. Because that's one of the main things that attackers target. You, they want to get your login credentials. They want to get access into your different accounts. So it's very important to change every single login credential and to enable strong passwords or multiple factor authentication in every account that allows you to do so. So these are our five steps. And also it's important to remember that if you are a part of an organization and you get targeted through a phishing attack, please notify your IT department immediately. So that was our take on this topic. And if you have any other suggestions or any other questions that you would like for us to talk about, please feel free to write to us and we'll be happy to comply next time. That's it for today and see you next month. Bye.